tech or not tech, I'm curious, like, why are you optimistic for the future? And why are you excited about it? I think that people that don't get excited about a world of VR are in a bubble. Because if you ask any Brazilian in anywhere, if they want to go to VR and, you know, go through Paris and be able to see everything, they're going to be like, yes, you know, like, that's my dream. Like, I, I cannot afford to go to Paris, but like, this is like the second best thing. So I think that I'm extremely optimistic because I believe technology, obviously, it enhances the life of the bubble a little bit, you know, in us, the the, the people in, in California or New York or some of the, you know, the rich places in the world. Mm -hmm. But the impact that it has in, you know, a lot of developing countries and a lot of other places around the world is insurmountable. Think about it. I met my co-founder over Twitter, you know, who says yeah. Twitter is useless, like it changed my life. Wow. I met the guy who introduced me to Stanford to Facebook groups. I learned how to code online, right? Like there's so many things that at least for me were so impactful and changed my life so much and allow me to be able to come from like, you know, like the middle of the state of Sao Paulo to Silicon Valley. And that wouldn't be possible without technology. So I can even imagine what that's going to look like, you know, in the metaverse or in the future and what new possibilities that's going to allow people all around the world. That's it's so true. I even think people like in Silicon Valley, or especially in the U S like don't always have that view and understanding of actually how many lives it can change everywhere and the connectivity it offers, even what Facebook offered to people. Um, so it's pretty amazing.